would like to thank you for coming to share with us your concerns and your love for the country, love for the earth, and love for the land. I just want to share with you for a little while my, my deep concern about the loss of this forest, the loss of this land. My ancestors have lived at Lummi for thousands of years and we show them the baskets and we show them the things that we make from, from the cedar, the cedar we call the tree of life. Then they say, well, why don't you do those things anymore? And we have to say, because there isn't enough cedar. And they say, why? Teachers, Sadie Jones, and she teaches the healings and the medicines from the forest. Sadie, would you yes. feel like sharing? Yeah. <clears throat> I use an awful lot of this uh, of trees that uh, grow in the woods. There's, there's a cherry tree, a crabapple tree, and uh, spruce tree. We had a lot of spruce on our reservation, and that's disappeared. So whenever I make any medication for anybody, uh, it's I have to go to another place and find it because, and even at that, that's uh, disappearing.